Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from Last Stand Gamers, and welcome. So today I've got something rather interesting to show you. Now, this is a Mr. Handy model. Now, if you don't know what Mr. Handy is, it's a popular robot that you actually see in the Fallout series of games. And you'll probably recognize it quite instantly if you played the Fallout series. If you haven't, you're missing out. It's an awesome game indeed. So I thought I'd build myself a Mr. Handy that is like a maintenance slash help around the house type robot. Now, there is a military version. Version. Mr. Gutsy was green and painted up with a few more weapons and this current version is a very early sort of proof of concept and we're going to work with him a little bit further developing the tools on the arm and making it so it's a bit more functional than its current state but we'll have a look around the design so we've got the central ball that acts as his sort of brain as well as where the computer's going to be stored I wanted to do a much smaller version but I originally started out so small I couldn't fit all the components that I wanted inside and as we come around the back you can see we've got like a little power cell as well as the central core that leads down to another thruster at the bottom. We've got the legs, but let's have a look at the eyes. So each eye has a camera on board, as well as a number of gyroscopes, and we've got the arm here that actually allows it to pivot up and down and around, just like the one from the game. Still working on that concept, though. So the front arm here, we've got a little bit of a claw, and another feature that I'm going to add sometime in the future is I'm going to add this base so it rotates and allows the legs to actually freely rotate from the upper body, but how I'm going to do that, I'm not too sure to share. I might just cut it off from the top, stick a rotor in the middle, and then seal it back up together. So the legs themselves, we've got many different parts of the legs. The Mr. Handy model has a very sort of manoeuvrable type leg. You can see we've got cargo containers on the rear, and I'll connect these up with some connectors when I get a chance as well. And we'll have a full system that'll actually feed it up to the arm or the claw or whatever it's going to do. And for the claw mechanism, I'm going to work on some form of piston. We've got the grinder on that side, and we have a welder on that side as well. Now, the basic function of this little bot is to follow you around and help you out, and you can actually pilot and remote control it, but I've actually only got one of the main functions running at the moment, and that is the follow function. So I've actually activated Mr. Handy's follow function now, and you can see he's actually starting to move towards us and around. We can actually have a move here. You can see there's a little bit of a fruity bug with the arm there, how it's connecting and disconnecting rapidly, but at the same time it's still functioning. I think that kind of adds to the character, because if I move up and down with this thing, he starts to wiggle as well as follow me along, but it's still really cool. I've just got to work out some way of getting him grinding and do other functions. You see how the eyes have a slight tracking function up and down. You see the claws actually coming towards me as he drifts this way. Follow me over here, Mr. Andy. There we go. You see his eyes bobbing. It just adds to the realism, even though it's not like a super complicated robot at the moment. As the eyes twit up and down, I need, to, I need a way of making the legs so they're a bit more fluffy and feathery like they actually are in the game. I might loosen up the actual hinges in the legs so they actually flutter up and down as he pulses around the place. And this robot is a lot bigger than it actually looks. It's still a small ship, but still the eyes are a little bit too big. And there is some other functions that really need to be worked on. Mr. Handy, can you follow me over here, please? And there we go. Actually, I'm going to come down here. Can you track me down here too? Yeah, there we go, Mr. Andy. But I just thought I'd give you a quick look at this um, rather useless but quite fun little design that I was working on. Mr. Andy, I'm over here. Turn your eye and look at me. Yeah, yes, here. Yes. Oh, God damn it, Mr. Andy. You need some reprogramming. Anyway, I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.